means you are hi after after so can take it please take a seat so after uh, can i have your ic please i didn't need my ic okay my stock cost is ah okay that would be good enough just give me a moment while i do some recording yeah sure so after when was the training you had recently was about, it recent about a week ago okay that's good so do you know what is the assessment you are here for um i'm here to have the assessment for sell products and services very good very good i do have a few things places to do some recording sure. just for a while huh? sure So do you know how many assessment methods there are? Uh, I I remember my uh, trainer saying that uh, there's got to be a role play, mm. uh, and then after the role play, there's an oral question. Very good, yeah. good. All right, so I return this. Okay. I see back you. to you. So now I'm going to walk through the assessment, uh, explain a few things sure. in regards to the assessment before we start it. Um, uh, first, let me explain about the purpose of assessment. Uh, it is to award qualifications for the module of sell products and services. Our focus today is going to be on recommend products and services. All right, and the context of assessment will be based on your the ABC department's um, operating procedures and all the industry standards. Sure. Okay. Um, and let me go on to tell you about the assessment methods. Like what you were saying, you're right. It is about role play. We are going to have role play first followed by oral questioning. Mm -hmm. The role play will take about um, 20, 25, 20, 25 minutes. Okay. And the oral questioning is about 10 minutes. Okay. Okay, very good. So during the assessment, I will be taking notes as we go on. This is just for me to uh, make sure that all the requirements are met. Okay. And just to let you know that um, you have the right to appeal against my assessment decision in the event I had to give you or not yet completed. Sure. Um, the details I can explain to you when, when there's such a date. Is that fine? Sure. Alright. Okay. Okay, would you, would you like to highlight if you have any special needs? Mm, no, I'm fine that I do not have any special needs or special requirements. Okay, that's nice. So, are we ready to start the assessment? Yes, I am. Okay. So I'm going to show you the role play. So this is the role play scenario. Please go through and ask me if you have any questions. Okay. So you would be the what would be what would be your role be? Uh, I will be the staff. Alright. Yes. This is what you do at the workplace, right? Yes. So I will be your customer. Alright. So when I come in, you will go through the procedure of selling the products to me. Sure. Um if you're clear, mm -hmm. let me explain the the setup. Alright. Okay, come. Let me show you the site. Sure. Okay, these are the jackets we have. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one is 120, this is 130. You see that that's this the one with the just long, yeah. And there are two other jackets here. The price for this one is 140 and this is 150. On top of that, we have items of promotion over here, 20% discount. Um, with purchase of jacket. Yeah, and it goes at ten dollars each. Okay. Alright? Sure. And this is the mirror to mm -hmm. be Okay. okay, so okay. shall we start? Sure. Okay, very good. Just give me a minute while I get my stuff. So as I was telling you, I'll be recording as we go through. Okay, so um, I'll be coming in from that side as the customer. Okay, if you're ready, I'll come in. Okay, so let me just check. Let me just confirm. So you'll be coming in from there. I'll be positioned here. Uh, this is the way how we set. Okay, can. Can I? Mm. All right. Mm. Okay. 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 Okay.
Afternoon, man. Hello. Hi. Hi. Looking for any jackets? Uh, yes. Going, um, yes, I'm looking for some jackets. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, this is uh, our line of uh, winter wear jackets. Uh, okay. May I inquire which country you're going to? I'm going to Korea. Korea. Yeah. Okay. Um, you think uh, which which time frame, which period, which season? Uh, soon it's going to be spring. Okay, spring. Mm -hmm. uh. Yeah. Okay. Um, springtime in Korea is about fifteen degree, fifteen to eighteen degree. So you don't really need those uh, thick, furry kind of jacket. So okay. Okay, this this jackets will do. May I also inquire um, any special requirements for the jacket that you're looking? Uh, it must be easy to wash. Easy to wash, mm. huh? Okay. Roughly, how much do you intend uh, to spend? How much do you foresee yourself spending? About 120. About 120. Okay. So what we have here is based on what you shared with me, just to clarify, right? Uh, your budget is about 120 and you want something which is easy to clean. Mm. So that brings us to only about these two jackets actually. Okay. Right. This one, the price suits you is at $120. Uh -huh. uh, this one, well, it looks a bit thin but actually can double up as a business jacket. So oh, just yeah. to share with you, are you going for purely for vacation on holiday or business trip? Mm, um, it's okay. It's okay, man. Okay. Yeah, I'm um, Holiday. I'm, I'm just going for ah, holiday. Okay, on holiday. Yep. So what you could do is between these two jackets, right, uh, this one is at one twenty. This one is at one thirty. Slightly above your budget. Yeah. Um, so this one is all uh, you can wear it for dual purposes. It's okay, the hanger is okay. So for dual purpose, in the sense that you can use this for business as well okay, as casual. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Uh, they are easy to wash, easy oh, to clean. Right. You just have to put it in the uh, in the washing machine, take oh. it out, and then just let it dry on okay. its own. Sounds good. Uh, this one is more of. Uh, catered towards uh, kind of like a leisure mm. wear kind of thing. Correct. Uh, although it's thin, it's Teflon coated. Uh, so what happens is it will retain the heat when you're wearing it. I see. Uh, so these are the two that you that we have here. Mm. Would you like to try them? Yeah, I think I want to try this because sure. I can use it again, right? Mm. The same way I do. Yes. Yeah, let me okay. try this. Sure, the changing room is just behind them. Okay, alright. Okay, so are you happy with this piece? Yes, I am. Okay, in this color? Yeah, this color is fine. Okay, I'll get a new piece for you. Uh, on the way to getting a new piece, can I also introduce to you our store is having a discount right now. Oh, okay. So with the purchase of any jacket uh, mm. from our winter wear, mm. uh, what you could do is you are eligible to purchase these accessories okay. at a 20% discount. Alright. Right, and okay. they go for 10 uh, for $10 mm. each. Now, uh, you mentioned your way to Korea, it's about right. springtime, so you yeah. probably don't need the gloves, but okay. uh, the neck warmers would certainly do you well. Okay. Uh, would you like to consider them then? Um, let me see. Mm. Mm, how much do you say? It's $10 after the 20% discount. Oh, it's beyond my budget. Mm. Yeah. Uh, never mind. I'll just get that. Sure, man. So let me take this, uh, put it in our bag for you, and then we can proceed to the cashier. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Okay, Arthur. Thanks. We we'll put back the item and we'll go back to our seats, right? Sure. Right. Just give me a minute while I do some recording. Sure. Okay. Do you want some water? No, I'm fine. Okay. So, how did you find the <coughs> roll play? Good. I think it went well. Okay. That's nice.
Okay, so I've just finished my recording. We will go to the second part of the assessment. And you know what is the second part, right? Um, it's oral questioning. Very good. Right. I'm told for the oral questioning, uh, can I refer to my set of notes? Yes. Um, did your trainer tell you that um, you can refer? Uh, we were told that we could. Mm. So I just wanted to confirm uh, to make sure. Okay, can. All right, so are, are you ready for the oral question? Yes, I am. All right, the first question. Mm. How do you find out what a customer needs? Mm. Um, I ask my customer, um, ask them what are they looking for, uh, is there anything I can help them with? Mm. So what looking for, right, mm. and how you can help? Yes. What kind of questions do you think these are? Mm. Um, I remember, I think during training, the trainer was saying, I think, um, open-ended questions. Ah, very good. Superb. We go to the next question, yeah? Okay. How do you match customers' requirement to your product recommendation? Okay. So, based on my asking the customer what they're looking for, uh, what they're purchasing, like for example, I ask them where they're going, uh, about what period they're going, um, then I look at the product that I have uh, based on what the company is carrying, uh, then I will take the product that best fits the customer's uh, requirements. Mm, okay, mm. you have mentioned quite a lot of stuff, mm. that's good. Next question, mm. can you tell me one organizational procedure of presenting products to customers? Uh, one, um, I think one of it is <coughs> When the customer comes in, I'm supposed to greet the person, mm -hmm. uh, greet the customer, good morning, ma'am, or sir, mm -hmm. how can I help you? How yeah. can I help you? Okay, very good. That is what our so organization is standard about. Mm -hmm. Okay, we are coming to the last question. After, mm -hmm. Can you give me one reason mm -hmm. why you may need to present alternative products to customers? Alternative products. Um, I think uh, one one reason why I can uh, or why I need to recommend uh, uh, alternative product right, is, for example, when our store does not carry the stock for it, uh, does not carry sufficient stock for it. So what I can do is I can try to find another product which uh, best fits the customer's uh, requirements, uh, and then I uh, recommend it to the customer to see whether the customer want to purchase it. Okay, so let me see. Okay, very nice. Back across. Back across very few minutes, five minutes. All right, so give me just a little bit of time while sure. I complete my recording, and I'll be giving you your assessment. Results. Sure. So what are you planning to do after the assessment? Uh, I'm going to finish the shift first, then later on I'm going to pick up my kids from childcare. Okay. Kids, you said kids, yeah? Mm. I have two boys in childcare. Mm. So um, glad to say that you're competent. Yeah. Mm. Uh, let me give you. There's some signing you need to do. Sure. Yeah. But before that, let me give you some feedback. Sure. When it came to the role play, mm. I found that you were very, very prompt mm. in the way you were addressing the needs. In fact, even before the customer can ask, you were highlighting a lot of uh, the product features and uh, the range of products mm. available. Very clear. Mm. Very. Um, Friendly also, yeah, very professional, and also the way you were selling the, the promotional items, even though the customer did not want to buy, you didn't show any fee, so, um, so that was good. When it came to the oral questioning, each and every of these oral questions you were able to answer, and they were all like uh, straight to the point, so I'm very happy to congratulate you.
that you got you are competent for this right um, yeah, it is right would you like to sign in here your name and your signature okay thank you so much so um we have come to the end but before we call it today uh, is there any feedback you want to give regarding to the assessment we just went through? Because we we'll use the feedback to improve our assessment process. Um, there's no feedback to provide. I think uh, everything uh, went on okay, went on fine. So Very I'm happy good. to say that. Okay, thank you so much. You're welcome. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah.